on guys? Welcome back once again. It's me, Malt. So yes, I am wearing the same clothes, okay? I'm recording two videos today. Relax. Tomorrow? Today? Whenever this goes up, I might be getting tattooed again. I'm finishing my arm. Once it's all healed up, then I'll show you guys everything that I have because a lot of you guys have been asking about it. But what are we doing today? We're using this deck. Somebody beat me with this. And it's, it's pretty close to ones that I've used in the past. Like, um, I've thrown in minions um, instead of the spear goblins. And, um, and otherwise, it's like the exact same. So, it's not like... The, the only thing that I'm copying about this guy is the, the goblins in it. It's the spear gobs. Um, but guys, it's 2.6 elixir. It's 2.6 elixir. No, a lot of you guys don't have the log or the miner. So, we're just going to have a little bit of fun. Showing you guys what's going on. It's a crate. I mean, 2.6 elixir. That's, that's pretty cheap. That's pretty cheap. And the good thing about it is you can cycle through um, your inferno towers. So, like, if someone drops off a giant in the back of their de in the back of their um, in the back of their side, I can drop off an inferno tower, and they're gonna be like, "Oh, that was stupid." By the time I get there, it's gonna be half health. But then at that point, I can drop off another one. So um, that's something that I definitely love about it. We're gonna go ahead and just throw this in. This guy's already uh, BMing, so. We're gonna go ahead and uh, uh, and uh, mute him immediately. Look at that. I'm okay with that. Yeah. Uh huh. What you gonna do about it? You gonna drop anything off? No. Nothing. Oh my. I'm kidding. That's totally fine. Come on, get there, spear gobs. Get there before. Yeah. All right. So now then, here's the question: Are we gonna be fine? Yes, we are definitely gonna be fine because we're gonna kill him. And then we're going to go here. Whoa! Not good. Nice. I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this, ladies and gentlemen. Now that's a way to defend it. That's a way to defend it. That's a way to defend it, ladies and gents. Coming back real quick. Not giving him a second to recover. And hopefully we can take out this... Uh, nope. Not going to. <laughs> it was close. Alright, so that actually might be fairly bad. Let's do this. Whoop! Even though that was my uh, that was my counter for the uh, uh, that was my counter for the uh, mini Pekka, which is okay. We'll be fine here. Oh wow, that's no good. Go ahead and do this and go right here. Oh zap! Ah, ah, my zap went off too late. <laughs> I'm just gonna send in a naked miner. Okay, close your eyes. He's naked. One, two. I like that a lot. Oh, that was beautiful. Spear gobs? No, we're not even gonna need them. As long as he doesn't zap here. Nice. All right, so now my biggest goal here, guys, is just gonna be defending. Like, as I defend and as I use my log and stuff, like, it's, it's gonna be fine. I'm, I don't really have too much to worry about, so we're just gonna log this all right here. Get rid of all them. He's gonna poison. Um... And I'm going to throw my miner over here. We're going to go right here with this. Yeah, and that's going to go down. There he goes with that. Now he's going to zap. Oh, he didn't even get them all. Nice. That's what's up, guys. He can have that side. We'll go ahead and move on over here. Ice Spirit. His, uh, his, his miner did an okay amount of damage over there, but look at that. We just did some serious work on that left side um, over there. So I'm not too worried. Well, let's just keep some pressure on him and uh, continue throwing this over there. That That's not going to do anything. That That's going to go down. Um, we'll go ahead and go, yeah, because it's going to kill both of them. Let's go Ice Spirit and right over here. Nice. There we go. Look at that. We crushed that, and that was a good, that was a Lava Hound deck. Lava Hound decks can be, uh, they can be pretty strong, especially when you have the Miner in there to go and predict the Inferno Tower, but he had no such thing. He had no such thing. Let's jump back into another battle here. Got to finish up my protein shake. I'm going to the gym in a little bit. All right. Um, we'll just start off with an Ice Spirit back here. Let's play this by ear. And let's go left. Nice! I like that. Oh, oh man. Yeah. Does he have a log? No, he's got arrows. 
He did just use his zap spell. Get there, skeletons. Okay, I see you. That knight is actually probably going to do a good amount of damage to us, which I don't really like. Going here again. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. I definitely like that. And now let's just go ahead and get an Inferno Tower down. Just because we can cycle back through to it. Totally fine with it. It's going to do a lot of good damage for us. Uh, we'll go ahead and zap right here. And the Inferno should take out the wizard. Nope. But it's going to go down anyways. And now we're going to head right back over to where we just came from with the Miner in the Goblin Barrel. Zap. No zap for him. Arrows, though. All right. So what does that mean for us? That means that he has... Um, Means that he does have his zap available, so we just have to be ready. He's not going to use it. Nice. He didn't use his zap. That's perfect. What does he have as... Like, we haven't seen what his damage dealing card yet. Um, let me go ahead and... There it is, right there. There it is, right there. We're going to go ahead. We're going to drop off our Inferno Tower now, guys. And um, we'll be able to cycle back through to it very, very quickly. Um, even if he zaps. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just go back here with this and He's gonna fireball. Does he have a miner? Is that what I just saw right there? We're gonna do this. We're gonna zap it already got melted. It already got absolutely Shredded guys and as you saw we dropped that off really really early um, Let's just go ahead and do this again because he's gonna zap up there and Then we'll go ahead and do this. He's gonna arrow right there. Our inferno tower is still up. Let's uh, okay good I was about to say I need to try and bring over my um, need to try and bring over his things right there. Boom! Nice. That tower is taking a lot of damage. Let's just go ahead and zap that as well to deal a little bit more. Time is running out for him. Um, now we'll go Inferno, and his tower is officially down. Boom! Right here, logging it all away as we deal a little bit more damage from it all. Zap again. Oh, it's beautiful. Guys, this deck is working really, really well for us right now. I dig this. I dig this. I dig this. That's what's up. The, the, the best part about it is not the cycling of, like, the Goblin Barrel or the Miner or anything like that. To me, it's, it's being able to cycle that Inferno Tower and defend really well with it. Because people zap, and then you can defend with, excuse me, you can defend with the Skeletons or whatever else. And then you can drop off another Inferno Tower. So that's that's one reason why it's working really well. We're at 4820 right now. <sighs> Vendetta. I don't even know who this guy is. I I, uh, I gasped like that to catch my breath. Because sometimes I talk really, really fast. And then I'm like, oh, I'm forgetting to breathe. Uh-oh. Do you guys ever do that? you guys ever forget to breathe? See, so right here, guys, we're going to go ahead and... He probably has a lightning spell. Um, I'm going to go ahead and drop off this Inferno Tower. Like, I'm dropping it off right now. And then we'll be able to cycle through to another one um, in just a little bit. So, he definitely has a Lightning Spell. I wouldn't doubt it. Yep, there it is right there. Let's just go ahead and um, kill this with these. Boom! Spear Gobs are going to kill those as they stay alive. One's going to go to that other side. Dope. See, so we're fine. We're fine. Look at that. Ah, oh, I gave him some splash damage over there. What did he... He arrowed my goblins, right? Yeah, he arrowed my goblins. Um, let's throw them right here and see if we can see. Ah, <laughs> no. Oh, I didn't like that at all. I didn't like that at all, guys. It's probably going to arrow those, though. Yep. Whoa. Hey, come here. Whoop. Yeah. What's he going to arrow? What's he going to arrow? Nice. I didn't. Ow. What in the world was that? I just hit my funny bone real weird like. Oh my gosh, that was super weird. You guys ever do that? Oh, I didn't like that. My whole like left arm went numb for a second. Yeah. Don't do it. Yes. Darling. 
And yeah. Hey, come over here. Nice, guys. Look at that. We got some good damage done right there. And I'm just going to keep on. I'm literally just going to keep on sending. Oh! All of that. We got to get. We have to get an ice spirit up in here real bad. No, he froze it off. No! Zap! Zap! Woo! That was so unbelievably close. Nice! Uh oh. No! I think we might have time, guys. Yes! Yes, sir! Ah! Uh, there it is, going up against. Look at my miner. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. I'm sorry. I'm in a good mood. I'm in a good mood here. We're waking up. We're waking up. Oh. Stretch it out. Ah! Ah! Okay. How are we looking in the clan? Let's donate a mega minion. Look at this guy. What's he doing? Meta. <laughs> it's okay. Do what makes you happy. This is meta too, but that's more my type of meta. It's so funny. There's like there's different types of meta that people enjoy. Um, I don't like he the heavy meta where it's like giant bowler lightning, like expensive decks where you make massive pushes. I like quick gameplay. Let's go into another one here. You guys are the best. Oh my gosh, you're the best. What are y'all doing for Christmas? Do you celebrate Christmas? Do you not celebrate Christmas? Let me know down below. I'd be interested to know. I would. I'm not lying. My ice spirit. <laughs> Let's see if he defends it. Defend the ice spirit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I like this. We'll just go to go spear guy. Oh, Mr. Knight. Watch this though. This this is one of the things that I really like doing. Goblin, goblin barreling. Um, things like that. And then, yeah. Can you kill him, please? Watch this. Coming in hot. Oh, we got spear gobs too. Oh, right as he spins six elixir. Woo! Oh! Oh, man! Oh, God! I was so stoked. We were about to... <laughs> Those skeletons were going to town on that tower. That was ridiculous. And we got off a zap over there, which is perfect. I'm just going to send this goblin barrel in. What does he have? I don't even know what this guy's playing with right now. There you go, goblins. My mans. Yeah. What you think? I'm dumb? Oh, it's beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. I'm in a weird mood, but you guys can deal with it. Oh, those skellies. If I zap. Oh. He left the match! <laughs> Guys, he left the match. Guys, he left. He just left the match. Oh my gosh. Well played. Well played, goblins. Hey, goblins. Well freaking played. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about, man. We shut that hog push down immediately. <laughs> oh, was he a level 13? I don't remember. It doesn't really matter. I, I view level 12s and 13s the same in my eyes because um, the only difference is the little bit of damage that their towers do and um, the little less health because most of them have max cards. Um, so... Now, 11s, yeah, if you beat me as an 11, which has happened, for sure, uh, grats to you. You're a freaking beast. I've had some 10s put me on the loop, too, when I was, like, messing around. Woo! All right, so we got a little bit of time, so I'll see you on a second. Okay?
All right, we're back. Night Stalker, bruh, you come to my house and you stalk me at night, it's over. I ain't playing these games, Night Stalker. What you got? Is it, this is like the same deck that we just faced. Get ready for the Hog Rider. I need seven Elixir. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's gonna zap it. It's not gonna help him any. Told you guys. I told y'all that zap wasn't gonna help him any. Look at the knight just going to town. Get it, knight. Oh, Can't sleep on nights, guys. Alright, let's be ridiculous here. Y'all ready for this? Oh. I need to uh, I need to wait here for my uh, for my inferno. Here he comes. Oh, uh, I gave him the perfect zap right there too. That's right though. One of them's gonna stay alive. He just zapped. Let's get this here. See if we can get that spear god to do a little bit of damage for us uh, or distract for us. I like that. I like that. I like that. That's good. That's not bad. That's not bad. I don't know why you're sending cry faces, but hey, you do your thing, my man. I'm gonna mute him just because I don't want to be. You see that wasted arrow right there? Alright, I'm just cycling through so that I can have my Inferno up and ready. Gonna kind of try and throw him off here a little bit. We're about to hit double elixir, so I'm not worried about spending too much here. Here he comes. We'll go ahead and just log all this away. He's gonna fireball. <clears throat> and we're gonna do this. Oh! <laughs> oh. Uh oh. See, now that was one place where I probably could have done a little bit better. Oh no, we're good. We're, we're good. We're good. <laughs> Now it's just defense time, baby. It's just defense time. Um, oh gosh. Yeah! Whoop. He's gonna zap, we're gonna do this. And we're gonna do this. Yeah! Guys, I'm in love. I'm in love. I'm in love. What about you guys, huh? Are you in love with this? Huh? Are you in love? Let me know down below if you're in love. Not necessarily with this. And it better, not, it better not be with me. None of you guys better be in love with me. Because I'm not worth it. I love you guys so much. I'm in love with you guys. And with this deck. I will see you guys in the next episode. As always, make sure you keep calm. Guys, just relax. Relax. Keep calm and clash on, alright? Peace.